Miha is angry at me. He's like, oh my God, are you ever just gonna relax? Are you gonna be angry every day? Are you just gonna be crazy and fucking horny and angry every day? Are you ever gonna enjoy the peace of quarantine? No, no, I'm not Miha. I'm gonna be fucking angry like a real Berliner. Yeah, I'm gonna be fucking angry every single weekend. I'm not coming out of Berghain on the verge of an overdose. I'm gonna be really fucking angry, okay? Like, how is that gonna affect old people? You think we come out of Berghain, we just cough on some random old German? Like, get over here, Oma. <coughs> Take it, bitch. No, we just have fun. That's all we do is we just have fun. We can't even have fucking fun anymore. Never gonna be happy again. Except for today, because I found out Oktoberfest was canceled. <laughs> <laughs> Take it, you little Bavarians. You little Bavarian barbarians. You gonna cry yourself to sleep, Munich? Fuck, no one gives a shit about Oktoberfest in Berlin. Come on. It's for a bunch of bankers and countryside cousin fuckers in your later hosen. Fuck off. Miha told me that I should do a how-to video, that I should like share knowledge with people to try to help them in these difficult times, share with them something that I'm good at, and help them. So I thought, fine, Miha, fine, I'll do that, okay? So this is my little how-to video. Okay. Hi. Wait one second. Hi. Hi, <clears throat> hey, my name is Daniil. I live in Bilan. I'm an influencer, or as I call it, an influencier, because it sounds more bourgeois. This is my how-to video, how to blow an Uber driver. Okay guys, so the key to blowing an Uber driver in Bilan is to like really talk in code. First of all, you want to make sure, are there cameras? Because apparently, <laughs> propositioning people for sex is called sexual harassment and is illegal. <laughs> like, even if it's a guy, <laughs> it's ridiculous. Like, two guys? Like, you can totally sexually harass men, it's not a problem. This applies, by the way, to taxis and free now. Maybe not so much for Bill Koning, because it's a van, there'll be other people there that could get complicated, <laughs> but fun. So basically, like normal, you'd start chatting with the Uber driver. They'd normally ask you where you're from. And so instead of asking them where they're from, you ask them how long have they lived in Berlin, okay? Because you don't want to try to put the moves on a Turkish Uber driver who was raised in Berlin, because they're like more worldly. You want the old school Turks. You want the, the fresh meat. You need them, because they were raised in a culture where like the genders were like segregated so they probably had like a lot of gay sex in their teens and you're just like tempting them back into their adolescence you're like come on just pretend I'm like just pretend I'm your high school buddy let's do this and if you get like a white German guy don't even try okay that shit is not going down you want the sexy Arabs the sexy Turks the Persians the Afghanis oh that's another thing like the more war-torn the country is the better because they might be all lonely like maybe they left their family back in their home country and they're all alone it's just like if you hear Iraq or Afghanistan it's like judging Cha-ching, 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 cha-ching. So you have your little chit-chat and never say that you're gay. If they ask you if you have a wife, just say no. If you have children, no. If you have a girlfriend, no. And then just at the end, you say to them, I live alone. That's the key. That's the code. I live alone. And the last step, which is in some ways the most important step, is you want to make sure you have a location. You got to think about parking. Where are they going to put their car? If they can't park their car, where can you go? Can you go to the bushes? Can you go to an alley? You got to think beforehand how and where you're going to blow him. Preparation. That's what luck is. It's preparation meets opportunity. You have to be prepared for the opportunity to blow the hot, sexy Uber driver, okay? And you also want to make sure you have really low self-esteem, right? 
Like you want to make sure you don't really have that much dignity and standards. But who has dignity and standards? It's Belen. <laughs> I really miss blowing Uber drivers. Fuck you, Miha, for making me do this. Fuck you. Now I still have no self-esteem and no Uber drivers to blow. 